Good morning and welcome to Hymns by Request. I'm Greg Johnson and I want to welcome you to my home, to the piano, and to a lovely sunny day here in New York City. It's 11 o'clock in the morning here. I don't know what time it is where you are, but I want to thank you. We have had people from all over the world in these last weeks joining us for our hymns by request. Last week we had over 1,200 people. And I'm not somebody who focuses on the numbers. I know that's very important to lots of people. I like one person at a time. And if someone gets a bit of help out of this or feels joy, feels not alone, I'm very happy because selfishly, I've been blessed. I've been blessed by every one of these programs. Yes, I have, because I'm not alone. I live alone. I'm here on the 14th floor, right in the middle of Manhattan. And yet it's been, you know, nearly nine, 10 months of isolation with very limited contact. But this technology has made such a difference. And this program really began one Easter Sunday last year when I started to sing. I was feeling sad, quite frankly. And I thought, oh, I'm going to sing some hymns. And that always is a blessing to me. It, it lifts my spirit and, frankly, it gets the vibrations going. And so I thought, well, let me just see if anybody else would like to join me. And, well, the rest is history. So I thank you for being with me this morning. Let's have some fun. Now, the first hymn, um, Joanne from the Marble Collegiate Church is a wonderful connector, and she has been making certain that others who don't have technology in this format are still getting this program. And so she asked me if I would sing this song, and I invite all of you, remember, this isn't a concert. This is not a performance, it's not a lecture, it's just gathering around the piano using technology to do that. And I'm so glad I see people from so many parts of the world already. It's marvelous. All right, let's just sing away. Oh, Jesus, I have promised to serve thee to the end. I shall not fear the battle if thou art by my side. No wonder from the pathway if thou wilt be my guide. And that can be our prayer especially for the coming week. Now, normally I begin with this. You see, I forget things. Change my heart, O oh God. Change my heart, O oh God. Make it ever true. Change my heart, O oh God. May I be like you. You are the potter. I am the clay. Mold me and make me, this is what I pray. Change my heart, O oh God, make it ever true. Change my heart, O oh God, make me more like you. This morning, oops, with the sun shining so brightly here in Manhattan, I think it's time to sing Sunshine in My Soul. Here we go. We'll start with the chorus and then do the verse. That's always the part people know. Oh, there's sunshine, a beautiful sun. 
sunshine where the peaceful are happy moments roll when Jesus shows his smiling face there is sunshine in my soul there is sunshine in my soul today more glorious and bright than glows in any earthly sky for Jesus is my light oh there's sunshine beautiful sunshine where the peaceful happy moments roll when Jesus shows his smiling face there is sunshine in my soul. And another great song. I've got peace like a river. I've got love like an ocean. I've got joy like a fountain. This is easy because we repeat the words. So Never worry about the words. If you don't know the words, I don't always play the right notes. That's not what this is about. Just join in and sing. I've got peace like a river. I've got peace like a river. I've got peace like a river in my soul. I've got peace like a river. I've got peace like a river. I've got peace like a river in my soul. I've got love like an ocean. I've got love like an ocean. I've got love like an ocean in my soul. I've got love like an ocean. I've got love like an ocean in my heart. I've got joy like a fountain. 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 That's a fun, fun song to sing. Now, to, uh, this is a song, it's written in a very difficult key, D flat major, it means we're playing all the black keys practically. Uh, Savior, like a shepherd, lead us, much we need thy tender care. I think it's a wonderful, wonderful song for us to be singing it. It actually started resonating in my mind. I hadn't sung this song for a very, very long time. And all of a sudden I was doing some work and the text, blessed Jesus, blessed that thou hast brought us, thine we are. And I thought, yes, that's an appropriate song for a week of so much change. <laughs> Early, let us seek thy favor. Early, let us seek thy favor. Early, let us seek thy favor. 
let us do thy will. Blessed Lord and Holy Savior, with thy love our bosom fill. Blessed Jesus, blessed Jesus, thou hast loved us, love us still. Blessed Such a beautiful song. And then another one that has been requested by three people, uh, and it's very interesting, all three people were from different parts of the world. One was from um, Tanzania in Africa, one was from Malaysia, and one was from America. He leadeth me, he leadeth me, uh, for by his hand he leadeth me. All wonderful songs as we're beginning yet a new year together. All right, let's start with the chorus and then we'll go to the verse. He leadeth me, he leadeth me by his own hand. He leadeth me. His faithful follower I will be for by his hand. requested and I'm going to do it because we did it last week and it's one that I am going to repeat this week because I've had so many people who said thank you for doing it amazing grace what a powerful powerful song we're going to do two of the verses the first and the last and then we do that wonderful third time through it where all you need to say is Praise God, praise God, praise God. You don't need any other words beyond that. And frankly, whenever we're singing together, if you don't know the words, it's not important. This is about feeling the joy, feeling the blessing, raising our spirits. And how do we do that? By raising our vibrations and by thinking of the divine. However you may define that word. That's how we do it. Amazing grace, how sweet the sound that saved a wretch like me. Oh, I 
conclude our broadcast this morning with probably one of, again, I know I sound like I have a lot of favorites, and I do, but this was a hymn. It was one of the very first things I ever sang as a solo back at what was then the Atonement Lutheran Church in Racine, Wisconsin. That's a long time ago, but this was a hymn that I very much loved. I sang it as a solo, and I've sung it many, many times before. And it's a lovely prayer as we go forward in the day, as we go forward in the week, as we conclude a day. Yeah, that's what's wonderful about hymns. They can very much add to our prayer life. They can add to our serenity. They can speak to us and reconnect us with the power that's within each and every one of us, the divine. Savior again, to thy dear name we raise, with one accord our parting that be your blessing as well. It's been wonderful being with you this morning. I remind you that if you would like to request a hymn, it's really, it's called Hymns by Request, and it's really quite simple. It's an email that is easy to say, and I hope for you to write down. Simply, it's Greg Johnson at gjp-international.com. Greg Johnson at gjp-international.com. I urge you to send me your requests. I think I have a request coming in from down by the front hall. Please join us, guide us with the suggestions and the hymns that you would like. And now I want to wish you a very blessed and a wonderful week. I look forward to seeing you next week on Thursday for Hymns by Request. And if you would like, tomorrow morning, 8 o'clock, is our Friday Morning with the Rev broadcast live from here in New York. Family caregiving, faith, and spirituality. Until then, onward 
in love and caring. Namaste. God bless. It's been wonderful to be with you.